Hey everybody, welcome back to Gideon Stuff. Today I have a very special first impressions video. Not an unboxing, because I already unboxed it, but we're going to do a first impressions. It's of the Concept Hellex. Helx? I'm pretty sure it's Hellex. Weird word. But, um, really excited to have this knife. And the story of how I got this knife is kind of interesting to me. So, a few months ago, I actually purchased um, one of these. Not this one. This is the full titanium S35VN version. I purchased one of the budget ones with D2 and steel and G10, I think. And uh, it was delivered to my apartment. And I wasn't there. I was actually at work when it was delivered. When I got back, it had been stolen off of my little front porch area. And I was so upset. You know, that was just, oh, that was awful. Well, a few months later, my good friend Sharpen Blade reaches out to me and he says, Hey, I just won mild mannered EDC's giveaway of the Concept Hell X. And I was wondering if you would want it. I, I'd like to send it to you. And I thought that was just super nice. That was absolutely amazing. He's a great, great friend. And I said, Yeah, you know, why not? And so he told Mild Manner EDC to send it my way. And it never got to me. I had them deliver it, not to my apartment this time, because I was afraid to be stolen, but I had them deliver it to my P.O. box that's back home at the ranch. And uh, never came through. And so Sharp and Blade and I, we talked a little bit with Mild Manner DC, and he said, yeah, it got sent back for some reason. I was like, uh, it's because New Mexico. There are some postal service workers I've met who do not know that New Mexico is part of the United States. And that causes some issues with deliveries and stuff. But, you know, he said, I'll send it again. I was like, okay, okay. So he sent it again. And, well, this morning I picked it up. And I didn't know what it was at first. When I got the package, I was like, well, what is this? I, what? And I opened it up. I was like, that's what it is. It's the, the Helix. And early Christmas present for me. It's... December 21st right now. Not sure when this video will come out, but yeah. And so I just want to give a big shout out to Sharpen Blade and Mild Manner EDC for getting this guy over to me. Um, yeah, Sharpen Blade's a great friend, great channel. Definitely check him out. I'll link his channel in the description below. But um, yeah, and I'll link Mild Manner EDC's channel in the description below. Another great channel too. But yeah, so anyways, this knife that I've been trying to get a hold of for months and just wasn't working, I finally have it. What am I thinking? So this is a Mikkel Williamson design, and I really do like it. It looks very cool. It's a big knife, and I like big knives. But it's not like, a, um, like an awkwardly big knife. In fact, it feels really good in my hand. Um, I love the jimping up here. Something I complain about all the time with knives is that they don't do the jimping right. This blade jimping is perfect. They did it, I mean, it goes out far enough to be useful even when you're choked up in this very generous, really nice choil. You can choke up here really good for some detailed work. Choke back here. My thumb can still reach the jimping. Maybe it would have been nice to have some jimping here, but not too bad. I even choke back all the way to here, do some chopping. S35VN blade, I love S35VN. I prefer it over things like M390. Um, just because I typically prefer a little bit of toughness with my knives, especially on something this big. And did you just hear that when it opened? <laughs> Holy crap. The action's really good, but let's listen to this. I hope you can hear that. That ting is mwah, chef's kiss. It's very, very nice. The drop, very good. The action, so the detent, I would call it a medium light detent. Uh, it's light enough that I can reverse flick it off the blade, which is fun, but it flips very well because they did the flipper tab right. It's a small flipper tab, which I'm usually not a fan of, but everything else they did with the slipper tab is spot on. So they, posi they positioned it, to, for starters, way, way above the pivot. Way above the pivot. 
Then they have this scoop that leads right into it. And that means when you pull this out of your pocket, you are not missing that flipper tab. And when you hit the flipper tab, there is so much leverage there. <laughs> it just rockets out. That is, oh, that is so nice. Very, very good. I like that a whole lot. Centering is maybe just a little bit off. No, yeah, maybe just a little bit to the clip side, but not enough for me to really care. The clip is interesting. It's a deep carry titanium clip, which you don't see very often. Um, it's an okay clip. I've had it in and out of my pocket a few times. And this little ball here is not the, my favorite thing. It's It works as a clip. It's not my favorite clip, but it definitely works. The hardware, I haven't checked, but it looks like it's all T8s, which is awesome. The cutout for the uh, lock bar, if you can see through the shadows, is pretty big, which is interesting, a little bit odd, but you know what? I can roll with that. Overall, really excited to have this knife. Cannot wait to review it. Along with the knife came a Hank from Shadowborn Hanks at Instagram. On Instagram, let's see if you can see that. You follow them. Um, I have always carried like a, a handkerchief. I carry a handkerchief a lot, but I've recently I just haven't gone and bought any Hanks. And this one feels very nice. Let's open it up. Yeah, this will be good for my Instagram knife pictures. Yeah, that is nice. I like that quite a bit. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Again, huge thanks to Sharpen Blade for sending me this, and huge thanks. Mild Manor EDC for putting up with all the baloney involved with that and for doing the giveaway in the first place. Um, yeah, really excited to have this. I've been Gideon, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Adios.